welcome, 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 collector. This is Queen here, back here on another general intuitive message. Okay, I don't know what's coming out, but we're about to see. Thanks for typing in. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for all your loyal support. I love all you guys. I think you guys are all amazing. And I hope your day, night, or evening is amazing as well. All right. Sending lots of love and high vibrations out to you all. Here. Hmm, what's the energy here, Holy Spirit, for this read? For the cosmic gods and goddesses, please. And thank you. Remember to hit that like, share, and subscribe button. If this video resonates with you, um, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. You know, if it doesn't, hopefully another one will. All right. Only take what resonates and leave what does not. Hmm. I have relationships. Why do other day? Wow. Something's not a laughing matter here, is what I'm getting. What's the energy here, Holy Spirit? Uh, somebody needs to believe in tomorrow. Somebody wants to be free. Somebody wants to be, you know, worry free. Somebody doesn't want to stress over something anymore. Um, love. Or the feeling of not being loved is what I'm getting here. Somebody's tired of somebody just like, I don't know, not liking them for no reason. You haven't done anything to somebody here. You haven't done a thing. Like, yeah, like. Hmm. Somebody's tired of being afraid. Somebody's tired of somebody being envious or, you know, attacking them for no reason at all, you know? Like, you feel it, you know? You feel that somebody, I don't know, wants you to feel uncomfortable, all right? You're not accepting that. You're an empath, whoever you are. So what's the energy here for this read, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. We have the death card out here. Wow. We have fear in reverse. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. We have fear in reverse. What else is here? Yeah, I just really want to thank you guys for the love and the support you show the channel. I really appreciate it. Much gratitude to you all. Oh, love and light to your families. Yeah. But I feel you're on the bottom of the deck. So let's see what this is. Hmm. We have change. We have success. We have service. We have guilt. And we have self esteem. We feel you at the bottom of the deck. So let's see. I'm getting that somebody needs some assistance. You know, somebody needs some help. Like, yeah. Um, but somebody's afraid to ask for help. Somebody feels like something's fading away or something's ending. All right. Hmm. But somebody feels like nobody's no longer willing to help them or something like that. But I don't know, whoever you are, just know that you possess the gifts, to, you know, that you're seeking in other people, that you possess those very same gifts, you know. Uh, a lot of times, like, I don't know, somebody's afraid to ask for help. That's what I keep getting here. Somebody could also be sick and afraid to ask for help. Okay. Hmm. I'm getting that you helped other people in the past, but now you need help. There's things change, like, you know, wow. Or maybe somebody feels guilty that they didn't help somebody when they needed them most. Hmm, that's a different energy, it's okay. Yeah, somebody possess a gift the gifts that they can help others, you know, uh, as well as help themselves. So let's see, but somebody failed to do something. Somebody missed an opportunity to do something here. Somebody made a mistake here is what I'm getting here. Wow. 
So let's consult the gypsy witch. What do we have here? Holy Spirit. What is the message for the collective? For the cosmic gods and goddesses here? Please and thank you. If you're in a position to help somebody and you know that they're ill or sick or whatever, you know, don't be afraid because, you know, to help them, you know, um, this could change everything for somebody in their life. All right. Wow. Hmm. So I'm giving you possess the gift that could help somebody change, you know, stop somebody from making a big mistake or something here. All right. Whoever you are. What's the message for the collective? Oh, right off the bat. We have the um, Glacia Lombalis. It says, Who oh, causes murder and bloodshed? Maybe you could stop somebody because the death court did come out first. It said, Tales of things to come. Causes the love of friends or enemies. Or can make one invisible. The number 25. Um, could be significant. This would be like the seven of wands. Okay. Um, wow. Maybe you're needing to defend someone. Or to defend yourself in a situation here. Or stand up to help somebody. Okay. Hmm. And then we have the Hierophant. It's sort of like, do the right thing. Or right, somebody needs, needs to do the right thing here. Somebody needs to help somebody that's in need here. All right? This could change everyone. Um, ch change something in someone's life here. Wow. You could even, like, prevent a death. That's what I'm getting here. This could change everything for, for somebody. Somebody's afraid and they're not showing it. Okay. Wow. Somebody also feels like somebody's not there for them in their time of need. But they were there for everyone else. Wow. Things have changed. That's what I hear. So we have the Hierophant. It says, teaches astrology, the virtues of the stars and the houses of the planets. And how to understand them transforms men with dignities, finds favor with friends and foes. So this could be somebody that you could speak into, or there was a, a, a failure, a failure to communicate with this person, or a failed relationship. This could be concerning a family member that you haven't spoken to, or maybe that you haven't seen. Okay, maybe um. Somebody needs to reach out to somebody and, you know, offer a helping hand or something uh, to someone in need here. Or you may be the one that's in need, okay, and you feel like you've helped everybody, but nobody's helping you, okay? Yeah, you feel restricted here, or somebody's feeling restricted. Hmm. I'm here and I want to find a way out, or I want to, I want something to change, or like, yeah, you could help somebody or maybe somebody's crying out to you, okay? They need to see you. Maybe they haven't saw you in a while, all right? Wow. We got the star card here, okay? Like, yeah, something needs to be restored. Hope needs to be restored in the situation here, okay? Maybe, like I said, this is could be family. You need to make friends with your family or something. Somebody needs you in your family. You haven't saw them in a long time. Like, maybe there is something that happened in the past, okay? Wow. Where you feel like, um, you know, you were there for them, but you need them now, and they're not there for, there for you. All right? Wow. Uh, maybe somebody needs to release some, some old beliefs that, of guilt that no longer really exists here, okay? Maybe you just haven't communicated with this person to see that this person may have changed or they haven't communicated with you to see that you have changed. Okay, somebody could save somebody's life here. Okay, by just simply, you know, 
giving us some hope. Let's see your Holy Spirit. This may not resonate with everyone, but uh, this only take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Yeah, somebody, you know, uh, is really feeling down bad. Like, they're really feeling like their end is here, here. Okay? But there's some answers that somebody needs to be. <laughs> they need to know something. Oh, do you still... Somebody needs to know somebody's still holding a grudge against them about something that happened in the past here. Do you still hold guilt over this person? Like, yeah. Or did you wish bad upon somebody? Or did somebody wish bad upon you? Like, wish some type of ending. All right, somebody's seeking some type of truth to a matter here. That's what I'm getting here. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Somebody, it's kind of for somebody to just be practical in a situation here. Like, yeah. We got the Ace of Wands. Like, there's an opportunity for, you know, someone to, like, get out of this guilt trip in somebody for something here. Okay? And somebody is doesn't understand why somebody's trying to make them feel so guilty about something trying to lower their self-esteem here somebody wants it to just stop you know they want things to change for the better all right hmm what else is here oh this could be somebody wishing bad on somebody wishing you know uh, an end would come for them because they holding a the grudge like you know wow for something that happened in the past you know a guilt trip of some sort here yeah yeah we got the uh, page of cups here maybe somebody's hold, holding I mean Holding the guilt trip towards a loved one, or maybe somebody's holding the guilt guilt trip towards you. Hmm. They're not changing. Yeah. You wonder if they have given it any thought here. Wow. Hmm. The Ace of Cups. You. Somebody's not feeling loved here in the situation here. Somebody. Is just wanting to walk away. Um, somebody won't let this guilt trip go. All right. Somebody keeps reminding them of something that happened in the past, and they just won't let it go. Is what I'm getting here. Yeah. I got legacy here. Like, hmm, this could be something that happened in a family. If somebody is holding somebody, um, holding some guilt towards somebody here. Um, yeah. I got a situation here. Somebody could be about to transition or something here, but yeah. That homecoming, I, I, it's in reverse, so I get home going, you know. Wow. This has something to do with a family. Like, somebody wants to, want for, wants forgiveness or wants to ask somebody for forgiveness. Okay. Um before they walk away or before there is a um, home going is what I'm getting here. A transition. Yeah, you know, somebody doesn't doesn't want something to end this way with somebody still guilt tripping them or something like that here. Right? They want to defend themselves, I guess, against a lies or gossip or or something. Okay. With the um, seven of wands here, they want to defend themselves here. What's going on here? If somebody was was blamed for something that they're not guilty of. They want to, the truth to come out. Okay, 
before something ends. This could be like a, a family situation. Okay. Hmm. Before somebody um, moves forward. Okay. Because they don't want to be a burden to somebody here. The Ten of Wands. They want to release some type of burdens here. Okay. Because before there's a loss of something here. What else is here? Uh, somebody doesn't want their legacy to be a failure. They want it to be a success. But it depends on whether somebody holds this guilt or let go of this guilt or something here. Yeah, because something that was spoken was was not the truth. That somebody's not seeing the truth in the situation here. Somebody is defending themselves, okay? All right. Or somebody wants justice. Okay. In a situation. They won't change. Because they're not guilty. Whatever they were accused of. Is what I'm getting here. But somebody's making a situation hopeless here. And they doesn't want to be. Um, remembered as a freaking failure here. For something they're not responsible for. Okay. Wow. What else is here? Yeah, somebody is seeking some type of truth here. Okay. Well, they don't know how to go about doing it, but... They're seeking justice here. They're defending themselves, you know, against something that was spoken against them that they're not guilty of. Alright? They're not guilty of, right? Somebody's, um... I feel like somebody's victimizing them or whatever, like... It's almost like you see this hand like reaching out like no like you know <laughs> they are asking for truth and clarity in a in, in a situation like oh is what I'm getting here somebody's heartbroken about being blamed for something here all right we got shadow work here. Somebody needs for somebody to be practical here. All right. Something somebody sent to somebody or gave to somebody or did to somebody. Somebody's holding guilt against somebody. But somebody, it was not, it's not the person that's guilty is what I'm hearing. I may be guilty of some things, but I'm not guilty of that. So, yeah. Somebody's wanting to come forward and and uh, seek some truth or help somebody seek some truth or something that they're not guilty of this, okay? Like, really, they wanted to see somebody succeed. They didn't want to see a failure here or this mistake or a missed opportunity of some sort here. Wow. I'm hearing somebody didn't make somebody a victim of a certain situation here. It has something to do with family here. They don't want this to be their legacy. They want the truth to come out. Alright. Hmm. They don't know how to go about this. Holy Spirit, what's here? What are the messages? What do they need to hear? Hmm. They don't know which direction to take this, but they want, to they want a chance to defend themselves against whatever they were accused of. Okay. I don't know. They don't want to be seen as a a failure here. Yeah. I've been um, emotionally immature. Or someone here has been emotionally immature here. Alright. Hmm. This King of Cups has been emotionally... Yeah immature they feel like you know wow somebody's feeling defeated mm -hmm. the five of cups here this is somebody's really sad here because somebody's been very insensitive okay with the oracle raindrops here like yeah Somebody manipulated a situation and they accused the wrong person. 
I'll be on guilty of this and somebody is wanting somebody to see the truth in the situation here. They're defending themselves, okay, and they have a right to in this situation, but I don't know. They're trying to figure out a way to get this truth out, but this truth is going to come out here, okay. That whoever this is didn't, didn't know. They're not guilty of what they're accused of is what I'm hearing. So let's see what this is. I'm making somebody lose something here. Okay. I don't know. Hmm. Somebody. Wow. This is crazy. Okay. Somebody was accused of I'm making somebody lose something or holding on to something or holding on to something that somebody cherished or something like that or hmm I don't know somebody's holding a grudge or making somebody feel guilty about somebody's ending somebody's transition somebody's death here that like they're not responsible for this all right um this is what your ancestors are saying. They're not responsible for their ending, but yeah, they don't. They want things to be made fair. They don't want to be be remembered as the person that that caused somebody's ending. Like they don't want that to be their legacy because it isn't true. They're not guilty of that. All right, they want to change the narrative because it is a false narrative when spread around this family that somebody calls somebody's ending and it's not true okay it's really breaking somebody's heart you know wow i'm getting that they would have did anything to help this person to just breathe all right to just breathe right wow to hold on to just breathe like yeah somebody's blaming somebody for for uh somebody's ending in a family situation here wow Maybe they were with somebody, a, a family member, and, you know, they're saying it was just my time, you know. It was nothing that they did. Like, this is really hurting somebody that somebody's holding this, this guilt, putting them through this guilt trip, okay, about them being the fault of losing a loved one here in, in this family dynamic here, right? Um they wanted to let go uh, is what I'm getting here um, this is what the ancestors are saying alright um, this person did try to help this family member um, they wanted to breathe but yeah they're heartbroken because there's been a lot of gossip and lies spread through this family about this person caused the ending um, to a loved one and this family dynamic and they're not guilty of it and they want things to be made fair. They, they they want the truth to come out about this. That they're, it's not their fault. Hmm. Somebody in this family is keeping a secret. They actually know what happened. They they may be the responsible one here for creating this. Uh, this ending to a family member is not the one that's been accused. It's someone else here. Okay. The charmer. The snake. I'm getting here. Yeah. they rather for... Uh, to put the blame on someone else instead of... Uh, carrying this bird burden um, around. Even though they're being forced to carry it anyway. Okay. Yeah. Wow, they rather for somebody else to carry this burden and this blame and this guilt instead of them, but they're the ones that's actually responsible. The snake, the charmer, that's what I keep hearing. It wasn't them, it was the charmer. I don't know. The one that's successful now is what I'm hearing. So, who's ever successful in this family dynamic? They're the responsible one. And that's what this loved one is conveying. Yeah, like, if you want to blame anybody, blame them. You know, 
the charmer. Wow. They just wanted to put the blame on somebody else here. Yeah. Your ancestor can't rest until the truth comes out. Okay. Wow. Oh boy. There's a rebirth of a loss here. Hey, this ancestor plans on coming back. To make sure that this truth comes out. That this truth don't stay covered up in the shadows. Uh, they don't like the, the, the person that got blamed uh, for this uh, ending. Okay. Yeah. And it's just to say, it ain't over till they say it's over. That's what I'm getting here with this five of swords. Okay. Beat somebody up in his family for no reason. Wow. I'm hearing they wanted to go. It was just their time to go. Quit blaming somebody else. It's not their fault. If any, if if anything, you know, they did uh, put up a fight to save this person, to encourage this person to just breathe. Wow. And it's heartbreaking for whoever this person is that they're trying to put this guilt trip on, saying it's their fault. Okay. Wow. Hmm. Maybe they closed you off from the family. You know. Whoever this King of Cups is in reverse. Okay. But you're not giving up. Okay. Until whatever this truth is comes out. Okay. Yeah, you're very ambitious, whoever you are. You're making the right decision. Or your ancestors are saying you're making the right decision here. You know, don't give up until the truth come out about this family member. You know, wow. It's the one that's successful. Hmm. Whoever you are. If somebody's been blaming you or having you feel guilty about something happening to someone in your um, family or something like that, your ancestors said, don't worry about it. You know, uh, if they have to come back, reincarnate and come back to bring this truth to the light, they will, they will do that. It ain't over till they say it's over. And they're tired of, of somebody beating you up about this is what I'm getting here. Because I'm hearing it wasn't your fault. Okay. You don't have anything to do with it. Alright. It was not because of any action you took or anything you did. Alright. If anything, you had faith, you know, that this person would make it, you know. Your ancestors are saying, let go of any um, anxiety or, you know, restless nights, you know. Wow. Just know that there is hope um, in this situation. You will be treated fair in this situation here. Your wishes are going to be fulfilled here. The truth is going to come out. All right? <laughs> and such as I ain't going to play. I'm telling you, they're not in the mood to play. That's what I hear. They're not going to play with this relative that's been mean to you. Okay? Wow. There's something about the legacy and the memories. Okay? Wow. About how this ending really went down. All right. It wasn't because of you. It was because of someone else. Wow. Wow. Let's see what this is, Holy Spirit. Mm. I was got to get this deck out, so never use it. But let's see what's in here. What's here for the collective, Holy Spirit? I've been guided to do it like this. What do you need for the collective to be aware of? Please and thank you. Tell us more about the situation. It says, as you, it says hurt, hurtful events. So there was something hurtful that happened. Okay. 
It says, as you endure this period, learn not to dwell on the past so I won't anchor you down. So somebody doesn't want you to um, dwell on what happened in the past, okay, during this time. Don't dwell on it, okay. They don't want to hold you down. Um, I'm getting that. Yeah, this was a hurtful event. Something hurtful happened. All right. Maybe somebody was, I don't know. I'm getting like. Mm. Somebody wants you to be happy. Like you've been through a very hurtful time of your life. You got blamed for something that you didn't do. They don't want you to be anchored down by what people say, you know, um, about something that happened in the past. Don't don't dwell on it, you know. Um, don't give up. Don't give up. I'm hearing them tell you don't give up. Okay. Whoever this loved one is, they don't want to want you to feel anchored down. They don't want you to feel down about it. They want you to know the truth is going to come out, you know. You're not going to have to to live a legacy of a lie that somebody placed upon you unfairly, whoever you are. Okay. Well, it says bask in the middle of moments where presence blossoms in the simplicity of now. You know, they're saying happiness is simple. Somebody wants you to be happy. They don't want you to be burdened down with somebody else's lies, gossip, okay, false narratives about you. I don't want you to feel guilty about something here. I don't know. It could have been an ending in a relationship or an ending in a life or it could have been like a, a tragic event. Okay, yeah, like this is a, a recovery. I'm telling you, your ancestors is, is telling you to, it says recovery, come back here. <laughs> it says find strength and healing as each step forward renews hope and paves the way for a triumphant resurgence I'm telling you if your ancestors have to come back to straighten this out with your family or your family members who have been treating you bad this king of cups in the reverse they coming back they coming back because they're not playing about you they don't like the way you're being treated and you didn't cause an ending to somebody you didn't you didn't cause this heartbreak that you've been blamed for you're not guilty of any of it it's the, the charmer there's a snake in your family. Wow. But they wrote it for you to carry the burden than them. Wow. Okay. Releasing burdens. Yeah, they want you to let this go. They're not your your burdens to carry. Okay. Embrace clarity and let go of what no longer serves you. Allowing new insights to guide your path. Yeah. Release those burdens right now. Yeah. You about to have a comeback. There's the the, the, the truth. Some, some truth is about to be shared on the situation here that you got blamed for. That you're definitely not guilty of. Okay. Wow. Hmm. There's things that people don't know about the situation here. Okay. Oh wow. So the information that they didn't didn't give up. Okay. The number twelve could be significant. They're gonna have to give up this information, this mystery. Okay. That this this unknown what they've been trying to keep to themselves. Want you to carry the burdens for you want you to carry all this heartache and pain. This this heartbreak, this from this hurtful event or something. Okay, they want you to heal. Okay, this mystery is gonna be revealed. And whoever did this, some King of Cups have got their fucking head in the clouds here, placing judgment on somebody else when they know that they're the real guilty one here. Yeah, your ancestors saying release the burdens off yourself. Yeah. Because the truth is going to come back if your ancestors have to come back in and, uh, wow, Re research. 
I'm hearing like, yeah, resurrect. But there could be some crystal clarity about the situation here. Okay, it was a hurtful event, but yeah, they're gonna illuminate uh, something here or put some insight on something. Okay, a newfound understanding of of the the content here. They gotta make something crystal clear to somebody, and they have to come back and tell them that it wasn't your fault. Oh my goodness, they want you to stand strong with defense as your shield. Wow, double confirmation, defense, seven of wands. Yeah, don't give up. They don't want you to surrender to this. You won't have to live out this legacy of somebody trying to hold this guilt trip over your head. You know, that's over. they saying that's over. they even tired of looking at it. If they have to resurrect and come back and straighten this person out, this King of Cups in reverse, they will. They want you to stand strong, okay, with defense uh, as your shield and strength and preservation, guarding what matters most. They about to make things clear. Uh, yeah, some truth about to come be coming out about a situation to make things fair for you, collective. If you got blamed for something that you had nothing to do with here, the scales of balance. Okay. Well, seeking equilibrium, harmonizing. All right. Wow. Something's about to be made fair on your behalf. Yeah, something's going to be made crystal clear. I'm hearing you. somebody got their they head in the clouds. But, you know, about some hurtful event that your ancestors don't want you to endure anymore. They don't want you to dwell on the past. Okay, uh, this person holding this guilt against you. Okay, they want you to let go of these burdens that was placed upon you unfairly. They're going to make sure things are made fair. If they have to resurrect, they're not playing about you or whatever. Okay. Wow. Mm. You have options here. First, when I first looked down this card, I see turn the page. Like, when I see turn the page, it's, it's like it's going to be a turn of events. Okay. There's more to this story, and it's about to come out, all right? Well, somebody is looking into something here, okay? Since they want to open something up or keep something open, they don't want somebody to heal from something, okay? Heal from a sadness that they even heartbroken about, but somebody's putting a guilt trip on them is what I'm getting here. Yeah. Wow. There's something... That's about to be revealed about this charmer, this snake that's in your family. Something they did to be made fair. I'm hearing it in your honor and in honor of your ancestor here. Okay. Wow. They're about to expand your horizons here. What else is here? This ancestor loves you, whoever you are. They don't like the way you've been treated. They want you to trust yourself. If you can't trust the people around you, you know, go your own way. But trust yourself. With your intuition out here twice, it says, let your intuition be the compass that leads you through murky waters. Okay? Yeah. This truth is going to set you free. Okay? And whoever this King of Cups is in the reverse. Okay? Wow, I ain't going to be able to fool nobody no more is what I'm hearing. Mm -hmm. This ancestor is going to make sure that everyone involved is being realistic. Because somebody wants you to have the guilt trip going on here. But this ancestor said, ain't no more fantasy island. Ain't no more fantasy island is what I hear. I'm going to make sure everyone involved is being realistic and on the same page. And I said, if you have to, baby, go your own way. Because they don't want you to be hurt. 
You've endured enough being blamed for something that you didn't do. It's a breakthrough coming in for you here, whoever you are. And they want you to, wow, there's a magical opportunity that your ancestors, I'm saying if they have to resurrect, they're not going to play about you, whoever you are. This is a breakthrough. Navigate life's many twists and turns because they know you've been through a lot. But they want you to do it with elegance and resilience. Stand strong. You know that you're not guilty of this. They know that you're not guilty of this. They know that you shouldn't have been carrying these burdens that somebody else should have been carrying. They want you to let them burdens go. Okay, and this King of Cups in reverse with they, they head in the fucking clouds. Don't want nobody to know what they were up to or whatever. Uh, yeah, you you know you can't trust them, but your answer wants you to trust yourself. Okay, the most high wants you to trust yourself. Okay, wow, because you've been through some murky waters, you've been through some shit. They done drug your ass to the mud, but that's all right. Stand strong. Your ancestors are saying, Stand strong. Okay, wow, it's gonna be a Ooh, it's going to be a river of release of emotions when this truth come out. This breakthrough is coming for you, whoever you are. Wow, it says, drift along the river of release where waters carry away burdens, guiding towards renewal. Something's about to be made fair for you. Somebody about to have a big breakthrough in a situation. Somebody has been holding a guilt trip over somebody's head for something that they was not, uh, they were not responsible for. Something happened to this loved one. Yeah. If your ancestor has a, has a resurrect, come back and make it known. They're going to do that for you, collective, whoever you are. Wow. It's this charmer, the snake, as they want people to be aware of, okay? Yeah. It's saying clear your mind, sweep away any doubts that you have. And know that you are right. You are right out alone. And you know it. But you about to have a breakthrough. Okay. You about to be able to let go of this guilt trip that somebody been having you on. Okay. Uh, they had some loss of life or some hurtful event that happened that somebody keep blaming you for. Want you to be guilty or they blaming you for. Well, they're not going to be able to blame you anymore for this. Okay, that's not your legacy. Stand strong. Okay, you're about to have a breakthrough. Release those burdens. Things are about to be made fair. Okay, you're going to recover from this. Okay, wow. I'm also hearing they'll say, go down by the water, go down by the river, and just let it go. Just, you know, release it all, clear your mind. You know, sweep away any doubts that, you know, that the truth won't come out because the truth is about to come out okay about whatever hurtful event this is okay they don't want you carrying this burden no more they, they yeah they don't want you carrying this burden no more wow sweep away any doubts that you have collective and know that you are right in this situation and you know you are you're seeking the the the, the, the truth here okay wow then it says, thrive and believe. Embrace growth and trust and promise. But your ancestors promising you this. You're going to come out successful. Okay. They may have wanted you to be a failure or point a finger at you. But things are going to be made fair. You're going to be able to release these burdens and clear your mind. Here and stand strong against adversity. Okay. Wow. It has some hurtful event that happened, okay? Wow. Your answer is going to make sure everybody's on the same page with a clear mind, okay? And they're going to release you from this guilt that somebody's been holding over your head. Believe in yourself. Your intuition is telling you right. Now, why they even did this to you or pointed the finger at you in the first place? Okay, they sent you through hell, whoever you are, but you're about to have a breakthrough. Yeah, you done been through a lot, lots of twists and turns, okay? But, yeah, things are about to turn around for you, collective. This breakthrough, 
It's going to come through. Just not navigate life. There's many twists and turns to what you've been through, but yeah, you did it with elegance and resilience. Okay. I'm hearing your answers to say enough of this fantasy island bullshit. You were not involved. Okay. And they about to make it known. So everybody be on the same page. Okay. This was a hurtful event here. And they're making you a promise. Okay. Your ancestors are making you a promise. They want you to keep an open mind. These answers are going to be revealed. Okay. <laughs> Into the path of fulfillment. With this truth that you seek to, to be exposed. Because you shouldn't be carrying this guilt. One more spirit. Please and thank you. I'm hearing the truth is going to be revealed. And then you ain't the one that was guilty. That's all I'm hearing. Okay. Wow. Let those burdens go. I don't care what they try to put on you. That's what your ancestors say. <laughs> your intuition told you the truth. Okay, you may not even be nowhere around. Okay, shit, what's behind the veil? That's what I hear. What's somebody hiding here? It's about to come out here. Wow. What's behind the veil? Behind the veil? Somebody's going to have to... Ooh. Listen, what I'm getting, the energy I'm getting... This is, that's why your ancestors want you to go by the water. Something common about the waters. Let yourself surrender to the flow of life. Life's mysterious currents. Just let it go gently. With elegance and resilience, you've, you traveled these waters, these rough waters, these negative times in your life, these many twists and turns with these lies. Okay, your ancestors is about to take everybody's mind out of Fantasy Island about this bullshit, about this hurtful event that happened, okay? Wow, you've endured this for, for a time, for a period. They don't want you to dwell on it anymore, okay? They don't want you to be anchored down. They're about to reveal what's behind the veil here, okay? Wow, it's going to be smooth sailing for you, okay? Because this truth is coming out. Oh, they want me to get one more from the Gypsy Witch Oracle. I'm going to find a message from this. The truth is coming out. You know, you're not guilty. You're not going to have to carry this guilt. Okay. Um, the real corporate will be revealed. Okay, the one that is really responsible. Right? The charmer, the snake that's in this family. The truth is going to be revealed about them. If your ancestor has to resurrect, I hear and come back and make this truth known is what I hear. They ain't gonna be able to camouflage shit no more. Ooh, you got shacks. You got the, the four cups here. The eight of wands in the reverse and the knight of wands in the reverse. The four cups. Hmm. Steals or fetches anything requested, including money and horses. Reveals secrets. Reveal secret things. Being questionable familiars. Somebody in your family is it's questionable. Yeah, they've been hiding something. They know something about this, this hurtful event that took place. But they tried to blame you, but your ancestors know what's behind the veil. And they're about to expose these secrets here on this King of Cups here. Energy here. All right. And these two were in the reverse. Yeah, somebody's about to learn the value. <laughs> wow, of herbs and stones. Yeah. Transports anyone suddenly from one place to another. I said they'll resurrect if they have to. To come back for you. Okay, to save your legacy. Protect your legacy. Okay, because they don't want to see you carrying no burdens that you don't shouldn't be carrying. No way. Wow. It says, uh, Renovi teaches rhetoric very well, gives faithful servants, favor of friends and foes, 
and knowledge of languages. Okay, so whatever was spoken, because it was in reverse, a lies, a, a mere lies is going to be exposed. All that rhetoric, you know, all that talk, all them secrets going to be exposed, okay? Wow. Amongst your, your, your family, your friends, and your enemies. All that shit's about to turn around. Because, yeah, this fantasy, whatever somebody was trying to hide behind the veil, that shit, your ancestors and divine spirit about to make this shit crystal clear. That you is not responsible for whatever this hurtful event is. Okay. Wow. You may be in this place all right now. Hoping that everybody find out the truth that you are not responsible for whatever this hurtful event is. But just know, like, it's going to happen so suddenly. It's going to it's gonna be like you teleported, like, you're going to be here. And then, you know, where, where they they trying to put you in this guilt trip or whatever, carrying these burdens, you know, for something you had nothing to do with. To over here, where, where they see clearly everything was just a fantasy made up. Somebody was hiding behind a lie. Okay, yeah, you got to be able to let go of all this heartache and pain, this burden, burdens that they have put you through, things are about to be made fair in your favor, whoever you are, just know that. Anything else, spirit? One from here, and then I'm going to close out collective. Yeah. One more final message. Yeah. Whoever wants to see you go through these trials is, yeah. It's going to be revealed who's really responsible and it wasn't you. Okay. Your ancestors said don't give up on the truth coming out. Don't give up on the truth coming out in this situation. You're about to find peace. Don't give up. You're about to find peace. Peace is about to be restored in your life. Okay. Well, what's been hidden will soon be revealed. Okay. Hmm. Find a message for the collective. Yeah. We have the health card. It says, I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. So they're telling you to take care of yourself. This this truth is about to be revealed that you are not responsible, that you are not the guilty party of anything, any hurtful event um, that happened to anybody, any one of your loved ones or, you know, if you were blamed for something unfairly, okay? Wow. They're going to really see who was behind it. Yeah. Spirit's about to make things crystal clear. There's about to be a breakthrough. I don't know if this was a... Uh, could be a court case or, or this could be another family holding this against you, thinking that you're guilty of something. You know you're not guilty. As uh, far as I know, you could be um, incarcerated for somebody here, but you're going to be released is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing release. If you are, you're going to be released, okay? Wow. <laughs> if this ancestor have to come back and let them know the truth here, okay, is what I'm getting here. They don't want you to worry, whoever you are. They want you to be happy. Listen, they don't want you to worry. They don't want you to worry. They want you to be happy. Okay, and let this go. All right? Because things are about to be made fair. Okay? I don't know. This could be a legal uh, matter, a legal issue. You may have been accused of some sort of hurtful event or somebody getting hurt, but you're about to be... Um, Release, or you're about to be um, released from this guilt that somebody placed upon you unfairly, is what I'm hearing. They don't want you to give up. Don't give up hope. Because, yeah, wow. Well, hmm. This person was in your life for a reason. Okay, I'm getting this is an ancestor talking to somebody. Hmm. Love, they got a lot of love for you here. No matter how much bad, bad light people try to shed upon you or whatever, 
oh man, you are clothed in love, whoever you are. That's why the ancestors are looking out for you. Yeah. They're going to make sure you're released if you're being, you know, held in any type of captivity or mental or physical prison. They're going to make sure that you're released. There's a breakthrough mm -hmm. coming for you. Okay. You've been through hell, whoever you are. You've been through the fire. You've been tried and tested, but this truth is coming out. Okay, that you were done unfairly. All right. That's what I'm getting here. And somebody's committed to making sure that, wow, your health and your love is restored and your honor. Okay. Wow. In honor of them. They're doing it in honor of you because they feel like you would have did the same for them. Matter of fact, they know you would have, okay? It says purpose. I know what I'm here to do. Mm. That's to release you from this guilt, from this loneliness. If they have to resurrect, okay? They want you to know that you're never alone. They are with you. They are with you. Getting justice for you, whoever you are. This ancestor, right? Hmm. They want you to know. <laughs> wow. This ancestor is really speaking to you, whoever you are. Somebody been trying to carry you through some kind of guilt, blame you for something that you're not responsible for. This truth is about to come out. There's a breakthrough coming. It says, I'm a limitless being. And I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. Hmm. I will honor the physical vessel that enshrines my soul. Peace. I am a being of love and I release all negative energy. I guess they want you to repeat that. Peace is being restored in your life. It says, I am a being of love. And I release all negative energy pertaining to any hurtful events. Yeah, it's going to be a general release too. You may have cried many tears behind something you didn't do. Something you weren't responsible for. But things are about to be made fair. Okay. Your ancestors is, is balancing this out, okay? Wow. Wow. You better have a breakthrough. Whoever you are, you're about to have a breakthrough. I don't know. Spirit, right let me stop here. <laughs> wow. One more Holy Spirit. One more for the collective. Okay, thank you. Achievement. <laughs> Achievement. Yeah, you got the seven of gems here. Oh, you got achievement coming. Victory, success. All right? There's no everything is going to be all right. Everything is going to be all right. Wow. Hmm. Everything's going to be all right. Wow. Just know that you're about to have a breakthrough. Yeah. The scales of balance here. You're about to have an achievement here. Whatever you were seeking, whatever truth you were seeking to come out, it's, a, it's about to come out. It's victory for you. It's victory for you in this situation. Okay. Wow. There's action being taken right now. Communication. All right. In the spiritual realm <laughs> to the physical realm, there's, there's a lot of movement. A lot of fast moving. Okay. Like, yeah, if you got blamed for something, and I don't know, you're waiting to go back to court or something like that, I'm hearing all charges drop. Wow. Just like that. You're about to have a breakthrough. I'm here. You're innocent. You're not guilty. 
it's the charmer who's the snake. And if your ancestor, or whoever this ancestor is, if they have to resurrect for this truth to come out, they're going to do that. <laughs> wow. They can take on many forms right here. They're going to make sure that truth and clarity, that things are made crystal clear about what really happened and that you're, you are not guilty. You're not responsible for any uh, heart heartbreak or hurtful event that you were blamed for. Wow. Now, if this is a court case, you're about to have some success here. Yeah. It's like going trust. Hmm. Your ass ain't going to play about you. The spirit's not going to play about you. you about to have a breakthrough. You're about to have a breakthrough. Wow. You've been through a lot. Man, look at that face. You've been through a lot. But there's some clarity, some truth about to come out about, you know, what really happened. Some insight, some newfound information, some some um, type of content. It's going to be made crystal clear. Your innocence. All right. Wow. Mm-hmm. Somebody else is going to take the fall for what they blame you for. For this new information that somebody's about to learn here. Okay. I'm getting somebody's lover. I kept saying charmer. Could have been responsible for this. Okay. Wow. I try to sell people illusions of fantasy land shift the blame on you or whatever it's not gonna work it's not gonna work i'm hearing they picked on the wrong one and that was you collective they should have found somebody else to try to pin this on hmm but yeah they gonna be learning the truth yeah it's gonna be made crystal clear hmm Wow. It was somebody that pretended to love somebody that did this to, to this person. And it wasn't you. But they held you responsible. They picked on the wrong one. That's what Spirit said. You about to have a breakthrough. You've been through enough murky water. It's a lot of twists and turns. Drug through the mud for no fucking reason. For something this King of Cups in the reverse did. Okay. They lied on you. But things are going to be made crystal clear. Clarity is coming through. The, the, the truth is coming through about this matter. Something's about to be revealed. You're going to have a victory here. Like You're going to be set free. From mental prison or physical prison. Alright. Till next time. Namaste for now.